The little hand says it's time to rock and roll. All right, so hey, if you know what movie I did a poor job ripping off there at the beginning, please leave a comment below and you won't win a prize, but you'll feel good about yourself if you get it right. And today we are at Woodley Lakes Golf Course checking out their newly redesigned up and improved driving range. But first we're gonna check out the putting green, the short game area, get a full review of everything but the golf course. I'm just gonna look at the short game area today and the driving range. Woodley Lakes is located in the heart of the San Fernando Valley in Los Angeles, California, just north of the 101 and west of the 405 freeway. So here at Woodley Lakes, they have multiple uh, putting greens for you to work at. The large one is closed, but it's a huge green. I'll tell you how big it is in a sec. I don't know, it's big. I'm gonna measure it. Okay, we have 27 yards across and 31 yards wide. You do the math, and 109 around in a circle. I don't know, there's some math. Tell me how big that is. Give me some square footage. You got the numbers. Let me know how large this thing is. Okay, this is the smaller of the two greens out here on the main property. It's, uh, I'm not gonna measure it because it's insignificant compared to the other one. It's like the backup green. I'm gonna roll to every hole. I'll let you know what I think. Okay, not too bad for a backup green. A little slow, a little bumpy. The other green is much better. I can tell you that I was there the other day. So, but for backup green, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. So they have a practice bunker here, which I love. I love to be able to practice out of the bunker shots no matter where I go. Um, but at a municipal course, typically the rule is don't rake. And I'm glad to see everybody's following the rules. Okay, I only need a few shots to tell whether this is a good bunker or a bad bunker. And what makes a good or bad bunker is how much sand is in it and am I hitting some turf underneath the bunker. And no, I did not. Actually, there's a fair amount of sand, so that's great. It's a little grainy, but that's just the style of sand it is. No big deal. I like it. I'm gonna rake it now. You know, I do, I actually have some professional experience doing this. For the US Open 2008, I raked the bunkers at Torrey Pines. I was one of the, I was the rake crew. In the morning, we had to get there like at 4 a.m. No, it was, yeah, it was like four in the morning. We raked all the bunkers. You're welcome, Tiger Woods. So anyways, I'm, I'm feeling inspired. I'm gonna try to rake this as I would there. It's a huge bunker though. It'll be one of my largest rake jobs ever. This is a, a, a large bunker, like 10 people could practice out of this thing. And it looks like 100 did and nobody raked. So I'm gonna rake. Not perfect, but it's a lot better than it was. At the US Open, we had like five people per bunker, by the way. I'm gonna sign my name in this bunker, just because, uh, because it did such a good job. Signed it, Mr. Short Game. Okay, by the way, that took me like 20 minutes, by the way, to, to rake that bunker. You're welcome, Woodley Lakes. You're welcome, everybody. Look at what I did, huh? It's awesome. Uh, by the way, the rakes, the rakes go outside the trap. Outside, not inside, outside. Because if your ball hits a rake and it's in the trap, chances are it's in a rake mark. And you can't fix that. It's messed up. Let's go get, let's go get some balls. Hey, how are you? 11 bucks. $11. I get 120 balls for that. It didn't used to be that expensive. I think because they upgraded the range. 
they charge you more for balls. I hope the balls were upgraded. And it's uh, $8 for 70 balls and $5 for 30 balls. I think the $11 is the best deal. Let's say if you did a bucket a day, five days a week, that's 50 bucks, 55 bucks. 50 bucks a month, that's $200 a month, just for you. Might wanna consider a private country club at that, at that rate. We got them, let's go count them. Make sure we're not getting ripped off. Hundred and twenty-three. I totally got three extra balls. How awesome is that? It's my lucky day. Okay, one thing I don't like always gets me when the yardage marker sign doesn't match the actual distance. As a matter of fact, it's nowhere close. I got fifty-five to the green from here. Blue is eighty-one. White is one twenty-eight. Red is one seventy-nine, and yellow is two o three. Look, I don't mean to be difficult, but I think things should be accurate. It's important. Okay, so where you hit to looks pretty good, but where you hit from doesn't look that great. Well, we'll see. All right, now let's hit some balls. So all in all, I really like what they've done with the place. It looks so much better than it used to. The grass isn't the best, but it looks a lot worse than it really is. So it feels feels like a real golf course out there. And I like hitting off grass, so that's a good thing. The balls, uh, some drew and faded at the same time. Might have been the wind, and might have been the crack in the ball, who knows. But overall, pretty good place to practice. I like what they've done. I like the upgrades. I hope you like the video and the tour of the place, Woodley Lakes golf course please subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already and get back to work we'll see you in the next video